So I'm going to take what we already know and kind of combine this to, again, relatively simple, but it is an additional step or an added plugin. So again, let's start where we should always start if we know that we're using data pool. We're going to go into our scene settings, into our built-ins, grab our scene plugin again, put our data pool plugin into there. This time we want to do a combination of two data pool plugins and again pretty simple just like we did before. So let's go back and get some type of object. We can use the torus again. I want to drop a material on it again just so that we'll be able to see it a bit better. This time let's go back into our built-ins into our data plugins and let's do the position again and we're also going to add a rotation too so this time we have two plugins on one container so we're going to go into the position and we're going to give the field name any name that we want let's call it something something simple that i can remember pause and let's say our format we want to move it again on the x and our rotation again we'll call it something simple such as rot and we'll rotate it on the y again I'm going to use the viz send thing one more time just to show you how we can send two commands to one container. So we're going to go ahead and put this on air. We're going to bring up our viz send module. And once we're connected, again, we have our command here that we have typed in. And we just need to know the two names that we gave it. We gave it a pause, which we're going to say equals any type of coordinate here. So we'll type in 50 and then we just need colon and we're going to say rot equals 90. So when I send this, it should move it 50 on the x coordinates and rotate it 90 on the y coordinates. So you can see what happens there. Maybe 50 wasn't enough, so we need to send it over a little bit more. Let's type in 150 and hit send. You can see what happens. Again, if we jump back into Viz Artist, into our scene settings, you can see how it picked up the two things that we just sent here. and then. Again, if you need to retype this and add new coordinates, you can certainly do that.